Okay, hey, welcome everyone. Hatman, Vincent Hatman, back at Knott's, not quite Mary Farm yet, Julie. Quite. But we've missed you guys. We had COVID-19, we were sick. So we haven't been back to Knott's in a month, Julie. It's been a it's month. It's been a month, but we, we're feeling better. We're doing not good. Not 100%, but we're feeling yep. better. And we're back with Bubba. We missed our friend. We did miss our and friend. And we're here on a <laughs> Thursday. It's a week before Mary Farm. Yeah, right? week in a day. So week in a day. Yeah. So we're going to see what's going on. There's decorations up and do our back to our weekly updates. Yes. So keep following us along. Vince the Hat Man, if you have not subscribed, be ready for Christmas time because it's our favorite time of year, Julie. It is. It's my favorite. Yep. Favorite. So follow along Vince the yeah. Hat Man. Our Facebook page is not then and now. And uh, subscribe to our channel. Okay, ready to go explore a little, Julie? Ready. Okay, let's go. All right. See you. Okay, Julie, so the birdcage is where it's at for Knott's Mary Farm. That's right. So if you come to the birdcage, you'll get to see two really good plays. The uh, Gift of Magi and Christmas the world Carol. famous Christmas Carol. So, And the booths are coming up for the Crafts Festival. So they're here, and we're just waiting for it to happen. Yeah, I can't wait. So, it's always my favorite time to see these fun booths. Absolutely. The booths are good. This doesn't look like there's one here, but there's looks like there's booths. It looks like the glass blower's back, and then the wood is going to be back over here, too. And Town Hall, there's decorations coming up. So let's take a little walk. Do you want to go this way or this way? Let's go that way. Let's, let's go this way? OK. So if you haven't been here, this is where the wood is going to be. He does hand uh, chainsawed, yes. carved animals, bears, things of like that. He's usually right here, and their booth is right here where they sell everything. So make sure you come down here to Ghost Town and check out the uh, hi Julie, sorry, huh? the wood carver here, the chainsaw wood carver. Yeah. All right, let's keep going, Joel. And don't forget, this is where Santa's cabin is oh, going to be. Santa's Christmas cabin. So Santa's Christmas cabin will be here just in a week. And that's they're going to have some really good treats oh this year. Gosh, Belgian look, waffles and bread pudding so and everything of like that. And then Mrs. Claus Kitchen's over here where you can usually make some cookies. So make sure you come over here to Santa's Cabin. And it looks like the reindeer are already up. The reindeer have arrived. So things are, things are up a week before. So yeah, check out this little reindeers. It's like little hints cool. of Christmas. Yeah, I like the reindeer. Pretty good. So come on down to Mary Farm in a week and check it all out. Okay, Julie, we're at our favorite fountain. Our Charleston fountain looks yes. good. Yeah, it's it not done really yet, I don't think, year. but... It, it is pretty. It's gold and silver. It's really festive. Yeah, that looks great. And we have, I think there's probably going to be snow down here and stuff too. Look at the big balls. Yeah, I think they'll probably, you know, add a little bit more to it. Yeah, I think so too. Mary Farm. I would think Friday, so. so. There's the nice, beautiful trees right there in gold and silver. Always love this fountain. Always love what they do with it. Look how pretty that is. Yeah, I know. Wow. That's really pretty. That's so let's nice. get it. Let's get the view from. Um, the back here goes all the way up. It's really pretty, really, really pretty. So they did a good job this they year. They did do a good job. It's so really we'll, different too. Well, maybe when it gets a little darker, we'll come back and take yeah. a few photos of it. But there it is. Beautiful. And now, Julie, yes. we have something else to see. We and do? it's not this. It's not the presents. Okay. Let's um, turn around and look what yeah. is here. They Our tree is here. Tree. We saw the tree last night. Yes. Um, coming in, Doug, Doug Reeder, who sent us a the live was on last night, and uh, they right. were they were getting ready to put the tree up, and they put it up. But before we show you the tree, let's show you home for the holidays. Oh, this that. is going to be the stage show that unfortunately last year only was around for like a week, and then COVID kind of shut it down. Yeah. So, so I'm yeah. really looking forward to it this year. It's a great show if it's the same show as a couple years ago. All the shows they do here are really good. So come to the Calico Mine stage. Now we've seen Summer Nights. We've seen uh, Scary Farm stuff here with yes. the crazy guy on the, mm, what know, was that, like a wheel. unicycle, big wheel. Yeah. And, uh, you know, we missed a lot of Scary Farm because we were sick with COVID. So we couldn't come. But we're back. So let's go check out the tree. All right. Okay. Okay, Julie, the tree is here. Yeah. 
is my one of my favorite parts yes. of Knoxbury Farm. They put the tree up last night and the tree is here. It's so pretty. They won't light it up. At no. least they never have before. Not yet. But um, not tonight anyway since we're only open until 6. But it'll be dark soon. But we just want to show you this beautiful tree as we walk towards it. And if you, every night they do a tree lighting ceremony with the mayor and... I hope the mayor, we heard his demise, but I don't know if that's true. I don't know. But, we'll um, have to see. Yeah, here's the tree, guys. With the star on the top. They really do Listen. a great job with the tree. They always do good Very with the tree. Nice. It's always really pretty. And this is no exception this year as we go up to the star. I'll zoom in on the star. And then zoom out. Let's get a little closer and kind of check it out. So the tree is up. This is what we came to see today, Julie. We came to see the tree. I love it. Look at and that. And it's here. You know, simply decorated, but really pretty. Oh, when it lights up, it'll be beautiful. Oh, it'll be gorgeous. So, yep. So come on down. The tree's here. It's but here. we're a week in, what, a week in how long a day? Uh, a, week? a week from tomorrow. A week from tomorrow so. starts Mary Farm. Right. So come check it out. All right, Julie, the All tree right. is here. It's here. I said, how cute. <laughs> I was wondering if one of those presents was for me. All of them. All, All right. of them are for you. So by the train with our friends, we have a cute little decoration here. And it's interesting to come the week before and then we'll be here opening night to see what the differences are. Yes. So yeah, this is really cool here. And if you turn around, there is a tree. And the decorations here. So come check it all out. It's more and more it's coming along. Not Mary Farm. Mary Farm. Okay. Okay, Julie, we're back at the Camp Snoopy Theater where they will be doing a brand new show. Yes. So make sure you come and see Lucy and the Van Pelts over here in this new, I think it's the meaning of Christmas. Lucy finds the meaning of Christmas. Oh, very cute. Okay. So come check it out over here at the Camp Snoopy Theater starting next Friday. The 18th. 18th. Okay. Yes. Looks like it's going to be a fun show. It'll be fun. Hey guys, so Fiesta Village is just no more. You can't even go in here right yeah, now. Yeah, so it looks like they're kind of widening their area that they're working on. Yeah, so it's completely going to be new for 2023, so it looks like they're going to be closed for a while. Yeah. So we're on the Camp Snoopy side. We tried under the bridge too. Yeah. And it's completely closed. So All right, we'll there's check your update. Back later. Okay, Jewel, we're at the general store and we have a few knots merch stuff here. Yeah, like we got a sweatshirt, let's yeah. see. Yeah. Some snowman, snowman, Knott's Merry Farm. It's got the windmill in the back. Hoodie, how much is it? $39.99. $39.99, okay. And this also comes in a t-shirt. Is that glow in the dark or something? Because it's all speckled. Well, I think it's just Oh, all it's the snow. snow. Okay, it's just snow. Okay. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, so if you want something that's so a t-shirt or sweatshirt. Twenty nine ninety nine. And then over so here we have like our first glimpse of Mary I think these were from last year. They these, look like they're yeah, from they last look year. Like last year. Yeah. Nothing on the back. No, it's just a just, just a fun sweatshirt. With the pockets in the yeah. front. Same price? Yeah, I think. Thirty nine or thirty nine ninety nine. Thirty nine ninety nine. Yeah. So it's a little bit is sprinkling in here and then they have a Christmas tree over here. What else do we have? This big reindeer. You can buy these ornaments, obviously, and this reindeer is really kind of pretty. <laughs> yeah, really and the tree, so there's little bits coming, but there's the first two shirts we've seen for Mary Farm. Anything over here, Julie? I don't think so. No, I think They're still selling Rufus more. stuff, by the way. Here. Still selling Rufus. <laughs> we love Rufus. Yeah, some reindeer, reindeer and a snowman. snowman. So yeah, come to the general store. There's going to get more and more. I think this is so fun. It it's like really a cast fun. iron little... Candles. Yeah, with candles. It, what, oh, what is and that? it smells cinnamon? like cinnamon, pecan, oh, yeah. cranberry. This one's yum. different too. Yeah. Oh, nice. Raspberries. Yeah. All right, so come on down to the general store and get your little Christmas stuff going on Fine. here at Knott's. Knott's almost Merry Farm. Almost Merry Farm. Okay.
Hey Julie. How are you? We're back at Knott's oh after God. a month. Oh my gosh, it feels like all this. Again. I'm not gonna mention it again, but we both had COVID. Yeah, we, we were both sick. really sick. I'm still kind of getting over it, but we went to Boardwalk and we look at this salad. I know we haven't tried the, any of the salads yet. So at I don't, does this have a name on there or no? Uh, you know, let me look. But there's chicken in the middle, rotisserie yes. chicken. House rotisserie chicken salad. House rotisserie chicken salad. We have avocado, onions, carrots, strawberries, grilled chicken in the middle, and then you can get blue cheese or feta. And we got avocado ranch dressing. So how's that look, Joel? Uh, it looks really good. All right. Well, let's um, right, so put gonna, some dressing on that, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna zoom in on that. That looks really good. It does look really good. I'm gonna might have to get some more of that dressing. We'll I know. Say. We only got a couple, but yeah. we're big dressing people. We are. Okay, Julie. All right. I'm going to try a little bit of So this. the rotisserie chicken salad with chicken, strawberries, avocado, blueberries, oh onions, and carrots All with right. avocado ranch and blue cheese. Wow. Well, that's a big bite. That's a big What do you think? Better than prop shops or just different? Different. Okay. I, mean, I didn't it sure actually looks have good. any lettuce in that, but all, there's a lot of lettuce underneath this. And there's blueberries, strawberries, avocados, wow. rotisserie chicken, it's even got fresh. croutons. Very fresh. Yeah. So what do you want to rate this baby? I would say this is a good solid four. Four. Okay. Yeah. What? Why isn't it a five? It looks five to me. I don't know. I mean. That's a good question. Or maybe it is, you know, I mean, it's got everything you would want. Does it taste fresh? It does taste fresh. Salads have been good. Prop shop have been good. But I think this looks really good. And there's blue cheese over here, too. Croutons. The guy's really nice, offered us everything. So. Yeah. So if you want a salad option with nice rotisserie chicken salad, yeah. come over to, because the, the ones at Prop Shop don't have, do they have meat? No. Um, yeah. Well, there's the one that has like salami. And, oh, it has salami you know, and everything. But yeah, if you want gro if you want rotisserie chicken, rotisserie come chicken. to um, Boardwalk as we're here by the stage. Plus there's avocado. Avocado. So I'm gonna give it a try too. But Julie says four. I'm saying a good solid. Solid four. Okay. So come get your salad at uh, Boardwalk Barbecue. First yeah. time ever for us. Looking All good. Right. Thanks, Thanks, Julie. Okay guys, thanks for joining us today. Eight days before Mary Farm, we showed you all the decorations that are up, which are a lot of them. Yeah. And we're in front of the Geo Shop, Julie. I love the so Geo a little shop. known fact, back in 19, gosh, I don't know, it was 89 maybe, um, Randy was his name, owned the shop, and I came and worked for him for the summer, and we cut cool. rocks, and we had a great time. Anyway, um, follow us along with our channel, Vince the Hat Man. We're gonna be here for Knott's Mary Farm opening day, eight days from today. We had a little COVID setback the last month, but we're back and excited for Mary Farm and everything that Mary Farm has to offer. Yes. And then we got Disneyland trips coming up. We have Dana Point Harbor Lights, Irvine Spectrum, some different things at Fashion Island we're gonna show you. 
we're going to try to show you a lot of the Orange County ornaments and things happening in Orange County. But we will definitely be at Knott's and Disney. We're mainly Knott's Vloggers. We love Knott's Berry Farm. And if you love Knott's, subscribe to our channel. Vince the Hat Man. I own a hat company. And that's why it's Vince the Hat Man. So subscribe to our Facebook page, which is what, Julie? Oh, that would be Knott's Then and Now. Knott's Then and Now yeah. for things of the past and present. We have like 300 members now. We're gaining uh, steam on that too. We are. So please subscribe to our channel, Facebook. I mean, our uh, Facebook page and our YouTube channel. And if you love knots, we love knots. And we sure appreciate every single one of you who subscribe to the channel. We do this mainly for fun just because we love knots and we love Disney and we love... Christmas is our favorite time of year, so hopefully we're going to be well and be able to do this. Okay, guys, thanks for following. We'll see you in the next video. See you next time. All right. Bye, guys. Bye.